Greetings everyone and welcome back to Graveyard Keeper, of course, and uh, what are we going to be doing today then? Well, I mean, we got all of these lovely things around here that I would quite like to do something with, but, 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 what I think we need to do is get out here and do a little bit of work on getting a uh, place where I can chop some firewood. That is probably the biggest, most important thing for me to do right now. Uh, let's get you down. And uh, we'll pop you right about here. And since I can access this from the side, I'll pop it right there. We've got enough room that we don't need to worry about it. Uh, that's that's definitely one thing that I've taken away from the first time we played through this, is that you eventually have so much room. There's really no point in uh, being stingy with it. It just doesn't benefit you in the slightest way. Uh, however, the first thing that I would really like to push towards... Uh, is getting a forge so that we can get some uh, work done down in the morgue. We need a pallet. We really do need a pallet. We need a lot of things. We're going to have to try and uh, approach things from a much more... Oh, I need technology for that. Uh, a much more sensible uh, route. I also want to get up there as soon as we can because getting wine... Oh, no. Really? Getting wine is a big, big priority for us. Let's go and get this sorted then. Please. Sharpen my shovel. I'm going to be out of energy in a moment. Yank. Drop this off. Right in there. Drop all of those off as well. And in fact that as well. You know what? Right now my inventory isn't so full that I have to worry about it. Right. Uh, hmm. No. We're going to get firewood before we do anything else. I do like though that we can use coal. Now, in our oven. It's actually pretty cool, if you ask me. I know that you didn't, but I don't care. Uh, let's go grab those. There we go. A tree we can chop. Marvelous. Oh, my lord. This takes forever with a, with a shoddy little axe. Oh, my goodness. That is going to be a, a rather large potch, if you ask me. Uh, let's pop that down there. And go and saw that into... Actually, no, no, no. Uh, we want some more billet. Yeah, there we are. So, more billet, please. Then we should be able to get a decent amount of firewood. There we go. Ah, we need some more of these apples as well. Yoink. All of the apples. I'm not going to go and talk with Ms. Charm today. I, I don't, don't feel in the mood for that right now. We're not even going to get close to finishing this. Well, drat damn and blast. Uh, well, hopefully we're going to be able to get a couple of these. Oh, look at this. I can put all six of them in at once. <laughs> Happy as the days of all days. Ah, amazing. Um, let's see. We want to make pretty much all of this bread. Go ahead and make all of that. Now, it's going to make them in batches. It's not going to just straight up make all of them at once. Unfortunately. Uh, we do have a little bit of a wait there, though. Mm. Okay, off we go. We're going to go and see if we can't find some berries. Now, there's loads of berries up by the beehives that we know. So we're going to go and grab those first. Uh, for the time being, we're not going to be getting any, anything from Comrade Donkey, alas. Now, how do we break through here? Let's find out. What is it going to say? I just... Uh, what? That's really cheap. Oh, there's going to be so many new areas I'm going to be able to investigate. And they are going to be very high priority for me. Oh, I can't grab any berries. Well. Wow. Well. Wow. Can't even... No. No, I left myself with not enough energy to get any more energy. Oh, woe is me. But uh, uh, they, those are very much places I want to investigate really soon. Why is that there? Who has been burning witches near my garden? I don't approve. Yoink, yoink. That'll do. Uh, you know what? No, we are going to go and grab those berries. And I'll eat them on the way back to... Actually, looking at the time, we could just actually turn in instead. It'll be merchant day tomorrow. Yeah, I think we're going to sleep through the night. That's fine. Then we need to deal with corpses. Then we need to start getting some graveyard decorations. Now, there are lots of new decorations for us. Oh, that's just amazing. All right, let's have a look. We should have a couple of new technologies we can get. We can go for hard space, maybe. 
Maybe. Getting the simple gravestones would be a big help. Being able to gather honey, also a pretty gigantic help. Getting primitive forging up and running, very nice as well. Uh, let's see. Woodwork, we could really already get to woodworking, that's kind of amazing. Stoneworking, mining. Hmm. I think for now though, we're gonna need faith for that. Hmm. Now, there are a couple of ways that we can get faith, certainly. Transplanting will work if we can find what we need for transplanting. But I think we're gonna grab beekeeping first. Unlock that. And then... Hmm, maybe get to, to woodworking? Nah, I think stoneworking is probably the better idea right away. So I'll grab that and then stoneworking once we've got a little bit of... A um, little bit more... Uh, handcraft EXP. Whilst we wait though, let's head north. We should find a couple of slimes up here, I believe. We're also going to find plenty of iron for us to, to mine. Oh, perhaps there are no slimes right now. Oh, that's a bit of a shame. Looks like the slimes may be gone. Oh well, sometimes they pop out. Ooh, have a look at you. There's no way I can remove it. Oh, okay. Well, that's a bit of a shame. I wouldn't mind. It would be kind of funny. Wait, wait, wait. My, my house is at the end of this. No, actually, I would mind. I would mind quite a lot. That would suck. I take it back. That would be a stupid, stupid idea. We could gather some stuff from there. I'm not going to worry about that just now. Uh, let's get this finished. There we go. You don't particularly need to go into town just yet, though. And we will go ahead and finish making the berry juice. Wouldn't mind getting the honey. That would allow us to do a couple of nice things. No. I don't think we're going to be doing that. We're going to resist. Pastry dough would be quite nice, though. I guess we can make some extra dough. There we are. And we can drop this off. There we go. Pop that in there, along with you. Uh, I guess I can just drop off the firewood, thinking about it as well. That's not actually a problem. Okay. Making some progress. Alright, next up, we are going to want... The anvil is something we want. Soon. At that. But... The stone stockpile, that's not what we want. Uh, wooden anvil? Well, I mean, we need it. Still, we're going to need flitch. And we're going to need nails. I'm going to have to buy the nails, I suspect. In the beginning. We could make a wooden marker, but no. I think we're going to wait on being able to put down some better grave decorations rather than going for those cheap ones early on because I'll just end up replacing them. And using up nails on stuff like that seems a bit silly. Especially when I can just save up a little bit more to the point of being able to use stoneworking to make really nice uh, grave decorations that aren't going to cost me nails. And that will actually be better than those, anyway. There we go. But we're not going to have a lot of that, those stones there. So we do need to be a little bit concerned about that, I guess. There we go. We've got 17 now. How much do we need? We've got 14. Right, so I need uh, six simple iron parts and some more flitch. That isn't going to be a, a particular issue for me for the time being. Let's head on down, see what we can do. What can we do over here? Got a couple of things that we could repair. It's not a biggie right now. What on earth is this then? We can not build a crematorium yet. We've already seen that that is the crematorium, but uh, I believe we are going to have to unlock it, despite the fact that it drew our attention to it early on. That's fine, though. Go ahead and grab you. Yoink. Oh, I was hoping that would actually be a log. Never mind. Uh, we should probably go and gather up some honey while we can then. There we are. And more mushrooms. I'm probably going to end up using the mushrooms quite a lot, despite the fact that I didn't use them much at all in the early access run. They just, by the time that I was looking at them. Property and forfeiture. For commercial use, contact, tavern owner, Haradrak. I should have checked that out earlier, really. 
because now I will be able to talk with Haradric about it. It'll be particularly useful. All right, let's uh, pop in, drop these off. Hello, bread. All right, let's get some more firewood in there. Yoink. Now, is there anything else I want to make here? It probably is. Let's have a quick look. We could make more bread without any issue at all. Uh, alternatively, I could make some baked mushrooms. Hmm, sure. We'll get some baked mushrooms. We've already got enough bread for now. Might as well sleep while it's night time. And we'll get a pretty healthy uh, wallop of energy from that. I believe there may be some things still downstairs that we can go and grab. And I'm going to make a bit more dough. And then get a load of bread going. I think that would be the best idea. Oh, right, okay, I'm out of, of uh, flour. Very well. Let's just get all of that going. Go. I've already got 300 odd. Oh, wow, really? Okay. Is there anything new I can build? New. Absolutely not. And down here we are going to need... Yeah, it's the simple metal parts. We, we absolutely need simple metal parts, so... All right, then. I'll take care of that the next chance we get. Okay, so we've got a corpse that I actually do need to uh, take care of. There's nothing down there that I can remove. I could chop... No, I can't actually chop those trees down either. Well, that's just an alliance. How about this? Need more simple metal parts. It's fine. I think we're going to see about getting some more graves prepared. We're a ways away from... Hmm. hmm. That might not actually be very difficult for us to do. Let's pop these down in a couple of spots. Oh, you know what? I really should have gotten you elsewhere, shouldn't I? Yes, yes I should have. Ah, uh, well. We'll just pop these down. I'm going to leave those two spots open just in case I want to pop something else there. Don't know what it'll be yet, but we'll see. I'll always have one grave prepared, ready for me to bury something straight away. I think that makes a lot of sense. It is going to drive my the quality of the graveyard down, but until we've actually got pilgrims, doesn't matter. The quality of the graveyard literally doesn't matter until then. All right, let's have a look. You're probably completely rotten now. Uh, not completely rotten, as it happens. All right, then. Uh, let's get you buried. It's not going to be the best corpse, certainly, but uh, at the very least, we're going to end up with a uh, decent amount of skulls there. Let's take you. Now, this one should have one um, white skull automatically when we bury it because there were no more red skulls and we removed something which would have turned a red skull into a white skull. We'll see. No, I think the uh, green skull there, yeah, is, is preventing it from being particularly nice. But still, we've lost nothing for that one. And we've ended up with an extra... Um, an extra burial certificate. So, just as well. But, we're going to need to keep an eye out for red flowers. Grab you as well, while I'm there. I'll drag this down on there. Now, <laughs> we should probably put this blood somewhere before I go into town. I am going to need some new parts from the smith. We should have the technology now, though, to get... Oh, being able to upgrade our tools would be amazing. Uh, there we are, stone working. Let's get you unlocked. Yes. And as far as the grave goes, I'm going to get another 10. Let's actually have a... Well, you know what, let's continue cleaning this place up a little bit. I may actually move these around and replace them with two uh, furnaces there. Just because that's a nice little place for them. Right. Where are the stone items? Stone stock about Stone cutter. We need some more nails. More flitch. Alright. And... That's honestly it. Very well. Uh, not a terrible thing, I guess. Chopping block. Yeah, we just need some flitch and some nails. It's not going to be a difficult one for us to get. I don't have a lot of energy right now, but I'm not going to go into town just yet. We're going to go up to the bees, gather some of those and also a lot of the berries because they are really good early game 
sources of energy. I'll also have a peek around and see if maybe I can't... Oh, hello. Exactly. Oh, dear. Not nearly as good as combat as I used to be. Oh, my lord. I'm very tired now. Damn it. It's not quite what I wanted to do, but all right. Uh, not what I was trying to gather, but okay. Uh, let's eat some bread. Yeah, we're going to spend the night just gathering up here, I think. Yeah, okay, we'll have some of these fried mushrooms. Good hearty meals they are. I should probably clear those out. Yeah, it's, it's mostly bats. I wonder if certain enemies show up on certain days. I never spent time to check that out. But if we can find a day where there are primarily slimes out and about at night, oh, that would be good. Because then we'd be able to get plenty of slime jelly. And that would be a nice restorative, certainly. There we are. We'll work through... Maybe we at this point we should head back. Just grab the last of the red flowers and we'll keep these ones. There you are, and some berries as well. There we go. Good enough. We can always eat to keep our energy levels up on our way back. Uh, should I? Well, I might as well. Oh wow, this is taking a lot of energy actually. Yoink. Get our cake supplies started. Because everyone likes a good cake, or at least I do. And... Pop. We are actually really low on health now. <laughs> My lord. That's fine, though. A nice sleep will heal us right back up. We'll probably be sleeping a little bit into towards uh, midday, but we don't have to go far into the village today. So it's not going to be that much of an issue. Oh, my goodness. Uh, you're still making some. Wow, okay. Uh, we'll drop these off then. There we go. Very nice. Right. Drop off the blood. And sleep. We'll just sleep until we're fully healed. So the moment we stop gaining any health, we'll wake up. Which is... Actually, a really long time. Okay, we're past midday now. You know what? I'm going to wake up. <laughs> My lord! That, was, that took a lot longer than I was expecting, I will be honest. Much longer than expected. Oh, well, we should still be able to visit the uh, blacksmith, though. I would hope. We'll see. Uh, right, let's be on our way. Everything else we'll keep, since it'll be a useful restorative for our energy. We need to get the uh, crops going just so that we can get peat. If I can use that to make flower beds for the graveyard, oh, that's going to be good. It's going to be very good. Now, I'm hoping the fact that we no longer have a dodge indicates that there's going to be something else that'll replace that for speed. Hello, Comrade Donkey. Goodbye, Comrade Donkey. I may be able to get to the town just in about enough time to be able to do everything I need to do and get back without that corpse having been out for too long. I also forgot to redig a grave because I'm a dumb dumb. Uh, right, okay, let's get in here. Haradric, 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 I need to be allowed to grow stuff. Hello. Uh, ask about the garden. I found an abundant garden near the graveyard. Can you tell me anything about it? Oh, the garden. It was seized by the merchant to cover someone's debt. I can't find anybody who will make any use of it, though. Hmm. I can give you permission to use the garden. Who else would agree to grow crops near the graveyard? Hooray! Sounds great. Good. But you still need to talk to the merchant. It's his property. It's not exactly proper to give you permission without his approval, but it'll be fine if you just promise to settle the details with him later. Sure, I'll talk to him. Right. He comes to trade with the, the locals every um, trade day. He owns the barn just south of the tavern. Probably is gluttony day, let's be honest. Uh, right, I would like... I can sell bread! <gasps> can I sell crops now? Is this a thing that can happen? Oh, happiest of days! Happiest of days! That is truly magnificent. It is wonder lovely. It used to be that you couldn't sell anything. So it was pretty much, you know, you use like two ways to make money. But if we can now actually sell produce. Oh, oh my lord. So good. Uh, right. I would like to buy many things. Uh, several of these. The problem is the price goes up every time. So there. And then it's going to be 62. That's fine. And in fact, grab another one as well. 
Womp. So, I think I need one more. Yeah, and I think it was two nails more. Yeah, I think that'll be good enough. Yep. Thank you. Take care, mate. All right. On our way back. I can't really hang around too long. But, you know, pick a couple of mushrooms on the way, at the very least. It'll do well for us later on, when we need the energy. And we're going to need the energy tonight. Ah, right. Okay. Maybe we'll be able to talk Comrade Donkey along the way. Why is there a chest? Close from the other side. That is Snake's exit point. Well, well, well. So once we've actually hooked that up, we can just get here straight from our house. Oh, my lord. Oh, my lord. It's going to be amazing. Absolutely fantastic. Grab these as well, because I want to be able to make plenty of things. Hello, Your Grace. Not now. You should have come talk to me earlier. You're a bad friend. Etc. 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 That's fine. We got everything we wanted, including some more orange flowers or red flowers, as the game calls them. They look orange to me, though. Yoink! Let's get you inside. Hello, moth. Thank you very much for landing on my glasses. Uh, right. Let's make you the best corpse we can make you. There we are. And oh. Your inexperience shows the surgery didn't go very well. You've made a mess of the body, lowering its quality. Well, you've got another chance. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Ah, oh, okay. Well, I mean, that could have been a lot worse than it was. But I love the fact that you do have mistakes now. <laughs> it's kind of cool. But this is not going to be a plus one body. It'll just be a potential plus three body once I've decorated it enough. And that's fine. But I do need to get this... Sorted quickly. Come on. Yoink. There we are. In you go. Yeah, it'll just be a, a regular zero body. But I'll have a potential of three skulls there, so, you know, that's not so bad. Could be a lot worse. Let's grab some trees on the way if we can. Yep. We want to bring these logs over to the log pile. Then we should be able to build some stuff. Finally. There we are. Thank you. Gonna get all this sorted. We will be building a pallet fairly soon, I would say. But getting the the basics under control, the ability to work with stone, the ability to work with metal, they're fairly important, I would say. Uh, right. So to get the stone cutter, I'm gonna need two flitch. Get the wooden anvil. I can just build that right now. The furnace, I'm gonna also need two flitch. Okay. Hmm. Well, I needed more simple metal parts. A bit of an annoyance, but oh well. Let's get the flitch made. The stone cut is going to come first because I can use that to improve the quality of my uh, graveyard. Stone cutter. And we'll pop you. Well, actually, we'll pop the stone cutter over here in this corner because I'll be able to access it from all of the areas around it. Then I'm going to build the furnace. Large structure though. I wouldn't be able to fit the two of them down there, unfortunately. That's a bit of a shame. Uh, it's a bit bigger than I recall. Alright. Well, we could build this here. Could I rotate it? I believe R rotates, yeah. Alright, well, it's not exactly the best place, but we can always rebuild one later. Shouldn't be a big issue. There we go. Our first night that we've stayed up all night. How marvelous. Okay, you sorted as well. I do need to bring a skull to the astrologer. We haven't learned how to do that yet, but we'll get there. Don't you worry. Oh, this is hard work. Thank goodness for all of this tasty, tasty bread. Right. Now, we are we can use firewood here as well. Oh, that's actually pretty cool. Uh, iron ingots, a uh, raw piece of iron forged in the shape of an ingot. Uh, I can make that a metal scrap. Hmm. Seems there may be some fail conditions now on things. Interesting. Very interesting. I can make stone repair kits here now. Uh, let's see. I might not need them though. Unlock. I'm going to need faith to get to that max bit, but that's fine. 
Can we make gravestones? Yes, we can. Let's get these on the go. Now that we've got these, we should be able to uh, get the graveyard up to a fairly good standard very quickly. There we go. Let's get some more. I'm going to need to get a lot more wheat from the town. And one more, I think. There we are. Are we going to finish in time? No, we are not. Much sad. Do we have any things we can drop off here? Uh, no, nothing else I want to drop off just yet. Let's go ahead and pop these. Uh, actually, I'll keep those ones out. Uh, but this can all be stored for now. Right, garden certificate. We'll go and use that straight away. And let's... Uh, we should be able to get some more baked mushrooms on the go. Excellent. Okay, let's go and use the uh, garden certificate. Claim property. There we go. We can build a garden bed. Uh, in fact, we can build... Oh, wow, we've got all of the garden beds now. Nice. Um, yeah, I'm actually going to set all of these up down there. There we go. There we are. I noticed that we might not be able to build all the compost heaps anymore, which would be a bit of a shame, to be certain. Can't plant anything here, and it's not going to be until... Uh, well, actually, no, we should be able to go and speak with the farmer. Hmm. Uh, I'll wait until we the next corpse, actually, because then we can have it. Well, Moon Day would be the next time I could give this skull to the astrologer, so maybe I won't worry about that for now. It would also take a lot of... Um, points to be able to unlock, being able to get hard parts. Ah, oh, damn, Dragon Blast. Oh well, more mushrooms. And I guess more of these while I'm here. Uh, ooh, I'm knackered, okay. We're gonna start... Are we gonna start moving slowly? No, actually we're not. Very interesting. I imagine Comrade Donkey will drop by very soon. I don't necessarily want to uh, run off just yet. Uh, drop these off. But we do have a reason to go into into town anyway. Uh, do we have enough? No, we're just one shy. Most vexing. Oh, well, we could eat the, the flowers, if nothing else. Got enough energy to do a little bit more work. Let's get you crafted. Yoink. And finish you off. There we go. Uh, yeah, honestly, Comrade Donkey probably isn't going to drop by at this point. All right, let's uh, tuck in to bed. Okay, hopefully Comrade Donkey does drop by tomorrow. Now, I can't remember how far off we are from having the graveyard at the correct level for the bishop to be appeased. I'll have to see. We need more mushrooms, too. And a lot more apples. I can't wait until we've got our own apple trees. That's going to be a big thing for us. Right, let's get the rest of the these fields cultivated while we're here. I may go and grab the next load of berries and just carry them around with me. Because right now we've already got one whole stack of berries in the kitchen. And until we can actually use them, not much point in stockpiling them any further than that. There we are. That's going to keep my uh, my brain from itching too hard, knowing that it is not finished. Let's pop this down here. Pop that right there. There we go. Ah, oh, I'm still carrying my... Um, my whetstone. A bit of an annoyance, but okay. You need a couple more burials to get enough money to be able to buy the uh, remaining parts. There we go. Thank you. Uh, we've got a lot of um, skill points, though. Awful lot of skill points. They're coming thick and fast right now. Minus eight. And I believe we're going to take it up to... Uh, plus five? Yeah, plus five. All right. I'll get this right next to being ready. Same with this one. I'll just take it almost all the way there. And then we'll stop. So it's very easy for me to fix in the future. Right. Gravestone. Let's get you fixed. Yoink. It's nice. 
And down here, uh, be a waste on you. Let's go for the ones that'll actually help with it. I mean, yeah, it will, it will help here. So let's get that one sorted. Done and done. Now, uh, most vexing. I mean, it would be nice to fix it, but and almost no point in doing it there either. How about you? No, you're a really bad corpse. You're a good one. Hmm. I'm gonna remove this one, and we're gonna replace it with a stone. Uh, it's still not gonna bring it all the way up to um, plus two, but it will give us plus one. And then we can place the wooden one here. And that shall take this up to plus two, which is all we can really hope for from this particular grave. Oh, no it didn't. Oh, point four, because of its condition. Ah, right, 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 right. Okay, uh, that's fair enough. How about over here? No, that that one is a horrible one. Uh, it looks like the those crosses are plus two naturally anyway. Okay, well, we've done about all we can do there. Time for us to turn in, I think. Can we perhaps dig? Oh, thank goodness. Okay. Thank you very much, Comrade Donkey. Please don't steal it. Thank you. Right. Hello, Not Mort. Please don't mess this up. Come on. Come on. Let's, let's do a good job. Yes. Also, let's do an even better job. Let's make this the best it could be. Oh, now I'm out of food. I need just a tiny bit more energy. Damn it. I used all my energy up. Most, most vexing. Uh, yeah, we need to get that fixed. We'll do that tomorrow. Uh, but we can get some more fried mushrooms. Okay. Uh, we only need enough to actually make... Uh, I don't know. Yeah, we're going to wake up this point. I don't want to spend too much time there. For fear of it wasting that good corpse. Thank you. And then I immediately go over there and uh, waste some time. I never said I was smart. All right, let's get in here, see if that corpse hasn't started to decay. Please don't do decay. No, not decayed. Fantastic, this is a good corpse. This is a very good corpse. And both of these graves should be just about ready for us to uh, place a corpse in them. I believe this one is going to gain an extra um, point uh, simply because it's... Yep, there we are. It's already nice because we managed to to over um, polish it. <laughs> we made it look even better than it had any right to look. So there we are. Three there. That is really nice. If we can do the same with a corpse there, that would be fantastic for us. Have we got any kits? No, we don't. All right, we're gonna have to take care of this. Let's have a quick read. Read, this area is closed due to the ancient curse. Please address any concerns to the Inquisitor. Will do, will do. All right, okay then. So, uh, tomorrow we can go and have a chat with the merchant. And I think that's what we're gonna wait on rather than going there today. Then we'll be able to buy some more uh, tools, uh, some, yeah, some more um, metal parts from the blacksmith as well. And hopefully, ooh, slimed. Hello. There we go. Oh, fantastic. So, oh, they are active in the day. You know what? I guess I just never came up here uh, in the day before. Seems odd that I didn't, but I must not have. See if I can. Oh, no, no, no. See if I can harvest some iron here. Let's grab a little bit more. Ah, really? Uh, all right. I'm on to you, game. You scallywag, you. All right, let's get you fixed. My whetstone is going to be broken soon. I think. How? Well, actually, no. My whetstone's doing quite well. Uh, we do need another tree though, so let's chop this tree down. Can I? 
No, it hasn't uh, it hasn't regrown yet. I don't really have much energy either. Uh, let's see if we can't make some slime jelly though. We should have the ingredients for one. Pop that in there. But we need to go get some more apples. Do I not make it there? No, I don't. Do I make it over here then? I must do. Oh, I need one more. And red jelly is particularly nice, I must say. Okay, so I'm going to grab a bunch of the berries. And we're going to use these to keep my energy up while we go and hunt slimes. So that we can have a much better way of keeping my energy up in the future. There we go. But yes, once we've got the means of making the compost heap and we're getting peat, then we should be able to make our... Though I think we can just buy the peat, in fact, so that shouldn't be a problem. Did I... What? Did I... I didn't bring... Oh. Hmm. Well, if there are no slimes over here, then it's okay. I didn't actually make a mistake. I just... I just, I did make a mistake, but it didn't, didn't cost me anything, so shush. But yeah, I, uh, <laughs> notoriously bad at sticking things in chests instead of pulling them out of chests. Don't ask me why, I don't know. I wish I did. Okay, so it looks like that is a daytime thing. Slimes in the day, bats at night. All right, well, that's actually something I can, I can definitely make use of. I popped them in here, didn't I? No, I didn't. Really? How very peculiar. Oh well, that'll do. So we want another tree. Let's get you. We'll go to bed in a moment. Got more energy, thank you. And then we may as well pick this up. There we and we can pop this over here. I'll make. I'll have to make the firewood in the mor in the morning. We don't have enough energy now. But on that note, we're going to go to sleep and wrap up this episode there. On the morrow, we're going into town. We're going to talk to the merchant about getting the farm. We're going to buy some seeds. We're also going to buy some uh, more simple iron parts. And then we should be set to make some pretty serious progress in the next episode. I hope you've enjoyed this one, though. We'll be joining me for the next. But until then, and as always, do take care, keepers. <laughs>